Hey y'all, I'm in front of the George Wood house, and if I had to pick one house in Williamsburg, this is my very, very favorite. Um, I wanted to video the tour guide, but that's not allowed, so she gave me a quick little review, and um, y'all are just going to have to listen to me tell it. So, um, this house um, is an original house, she said probably the most original house, even some of the glass, the handrails, she said this is the most original house. Um, but y'all, George Wythe is just a fascinating person to me. Um, he was a teacher, he was a lawyer, he was a scientist. He is probably most famous, and this is what you need to know about him, he was Thomas Jefferson, one of Thomas Jefferson's teachers. So Thomas Jefferson used to come in this house and be tutored by George Wythe. And we're going to try to go inside this house, and there are lots of cool things um, to show you. One thing I wanted to show you, um, the top story windows are actually smaller than the bottom story windows. And they did that because it creates an optical illusion and it makes a house seem taller and grander um, than it really is. Um, so I thought that was kind of interesting. Um, one of my favorite stories about this house, um, George Wythe was white um, and he had a cook named Lydia Broadnax who was black. And um, she, was his, she was an enslaved person, she was his cook and when he moved to Richmond, he freed her. Well, George Wythe was obviously very, very wealthy, and he had a terrible nephew who tried to poison him because he would inherit a lot of the money. And Lydia Broadnax, the cook, um, knew that the nephew was the one that poisoned him, but she could not testify in court, even though she wasn't an enslaved person anymore because she was black and black people could testify against other black people, but black people could not testify against white people. So I'm pretty sure the nephew never got any trouble. Um, okay, all right, so y'all, we're getting ready to go inside on the tour, so I'll make another video in just a second. Oh, fine. 